is Sarah Clippinger, and I've had Lyme disease for three years now. Uh, when I first got sick, I went to many different doctors, and they ran all sorts of tests, but none of them were able to figure out what was wrong with me. They even did give me a Lyme test, but it came back negative. Uh, knowing what I know now, that the standardized Lyme tests give a false negative about 70% of the time, that was really no surprise. But uh, eventually I decided to take matters into my own hands, and I sent my blood to a special lab that tests for Lyme disease in the States. And it came back uh, revealing that I did indeed have Lyme disease. And when I told my family doctor, he shook his head and said, I don't know anything about Lyme disease, you're on your own. So uh, I ended up going to a clinic in Mexico that uh, has cutting edge treatments and very compassionate doctors who understand that Lyme disease is more prevalent, more complex, and more debilitating than most doctors are willing to admit. And there I was able to receive intense but compassionate treatment and the care that I had not received for so long. Um, I think that what God has taught me through the past few years is just a deep level of surrender that my mind is his, my body is his, a dependence on him every day. And even though I refuse to admit that Lyme disease has a permanent place in my life, I have gained a deeper level of compassion for others because of it and I'm grateful for that.